So the CFM of your cooktop is uh, determined by the total number of uh, BTUs produced by cooktop. BTUs are the British uh, thermal units that measure the amount of uh, heat energy that each uh, burner, griddle or grill produce at maximum output. The basic formula is, uh, hello guys in this video. I would like to talk about uh, gas cooktops and determining CFM for range hood over gas cooktops. As I mentioned in the previous video that a range hood over an electric cooktop requires less CFM and the wideness of your cooktop is the key when choosing the power of your range hood. So a range hood over a gas cooktop requires uh, more CFM and more powerful fan to remove odors, smoke, heat and toxins in the air used by your gas cooktop. In general a range hood fan should move a minimum of 100 CFM of air and the max number of BTUs of your burners is the key when choosing the power of your range hood. In addition your cooking style or cooking environment so if you cook most of your food at high heat or cook in a small room space you'll need more CFM based on the output of your burners and types of your foods and you should keep in mind with a rain shot we often remove both heated and air conditioned along with our cooking odors and smoke uh, which is not cost effective if you turn your range hood on high at 1200 CFM to 1800 CFM you will be drawing in and venting out additional air from your home that has been heated or cold. Before selecting a range hood the first step is uh, you will need to decide what size of range hood uh, you will need so for wall mounted range hood uh, you can select to be equal or just larger than your cooktop. So if your cooktop is uh, 50 inches wide you will need a uh, 56 inches range hood 3 inches uh, overlap on each side. So the CFM of your cooktop is uh, determined by the total number of uh, BTUs produced by cooktop. BTUs are the British uh, thermal units that measure the amount of uh, heat energy that each uh, burner, griddle or grill produce at maximum output. The basic formula is uh, to determine the CFM for your range hood over gas cooktop is uh, 1 CFM per 100 BTUs or divide the total number of BTUs by a hundred. For example, if you have uh, two burners gas uh, cooktop with an output of uh, 14,000 BTUs, uh, if you divide the max number of uh, BTUs you have by a hundred, you will need a range hood to deliver 140 CFM of uh, airflow. So you may require more or less CFM depending on your cooking style and cooking environment and if you don't cook at high heat or greasy foods you will likely uh, need less CFM for your gas cooktop and if you cook greasy foods with stronger odors uh, like fish or high heat foods then you may need a uh, higher CFM or if you have an island cooktop you will need more CFM. An island cooktop uh, radiates heat in all direction unlike a wall cooktop while cooking with a gas uh, cooktop against a wall it blocks any grass uh, breezes or air flows. For islands uh, fringe hoods uh, you can select the 4 inches to 6 inches just uh, larger than your cooktop so if your cooktop is uh, 50 inches wide you will need 62 inches range hood and 6 inches uh, overlap on each side a larger range hood uh, may have 
uh, less or more powerful fan so to reduce the amount of uh, noise and lever the right amount of uh, CFM is to install a powerful fan in your range hood with a variable uh, speed control so that's it for today uh, I appreciate you for watching this video